now to New York City for the special 18th birthday party for the rising young singing star Leslie Gore. The teenage strawberry blonde was honored by personalities like Dizzy Gillespie, the jazz trumpet king, and a man known by millions for his years on television, Mr. Ed Sullivan. The party was also attended by Steve Cochran and a host of recording favorites. New York parties are unique in that many seldom seen names always appear. Here we find Jane Morgan with Peter Duchin and Johnny Carson's sidekick, Ed McMahon. Incidentally, Leslie Gore's record of It's My Party, her first major recording effort, sold over one million copies and was the number one disc in the country within weeks of its release. It's always refreshing to see a young, new talent accepted in the world of the show business professionals. This party, just like most any other 18th birthday celebration, had a special cake for the celebration and the occasion. Leslie did the honors, and with the honored guests gathering round the pert young songstress, proceeded to pass around the slices. Lizzie Gillespie, by the looks of things, approves of the baking. Always one to enliven the festivities, Dizzy very nearly got to Leslie's hand. The balloons started being retrieved for souvenirs, and the evening took on a mellow glow. Ed Sullivan was honored with the last dance, and a wonderful night in the life of talented Leslie Gore becomes a member. 